video if you saw the previous videos check them out if you want to um, just check out the the video channel page um, testing the computers with a live USB and this time uh, Linux Debian Mint Edition 5.0 um, figured I'd go ahead and make a create a you know live USB and load it up I heard sound and Dex 200 after installing that GameCap HD um, thing, and I ain't playing around a little bit with the uh, UMC 202 HD, but sealed the deal is that GameCap HD audio Windows decided something or other. I remember when installing that GameCap HD that is asking to install and do things that shouldn't have probably done with the Windows system, but it fucking ate it up the Windows OS. And um, I did have some kind of QT, QT taskbar installed also. And that might have funked around with a registry. I remember to get that uninstalled and removed was a little registry at at work. And I didn't, really, I didn't see any audio issues or OS issues when I did that. I'm usually confident in the registry. But when it comes to the programming of the Windows systems, I'm not. But anyways, long story short, um, loaded up, heard sound. And this is telling me before the audio wasn't working. There's not an audio switch. There's a Bluetooth Wi-Fi switch, but no audio switches. So I, I said, well, let's make sure these outputs, because I use these outputs. Those were okay. So let's do a little test with the um, Clips uh, Pro Media 2.1. Uh-oh. Sounds... Sounds like it's working, <laughs> so that's awesome. So I last left off, I remember very clearly that I have to reinstall um, what was suggested to reinstall um, using the Windows 7 CD or DVD, whatever it is. And my thought was I might need to downgrade. So I'll probably go into Windows, remove, uninstall Windows Service Pack 2 just to be safe, and maybe even all the service packs just to be safe and then reinstall from the CD and then upgrade with the service packs. So hopefully I have those archived because they're probably not available online. Um, but I'm pretty sure I have them archived. I probably even have them burnt to uh CD DVD. At least I know I did with the XP XP pro editions. I know I, I saved my service packs. I'll have to double check on that and then see what my CD is or DVD is if it's a, it's a service pack. But um, uh, yeah, I don't know. It's one pile there somewhere. So, okay. Um, I, know, I just want to share that real quick. Use a, a, another good use of a USB live, uh, live USB OS. Verify your hardware is working um, in a, you know, another known less hassle at times. Um, usually they're pretty stable, um, you know, Linux distro. Okay, I'll talk to you later. Be safe, stay healthy, and Christ be with you.